Can we hit this? Dude, oh my gosh. I don't know if we can. We hit it! Oh! <laughs>what's going on guys welcome back to the last leviathan this is besiege meets from the depths people say the open seas it's building ships on the open seas you do battle you fight you blow stuff up you kill everybody and this thing is something i found in the workshop it is by azabi contoris and is called the wall of terror and oh my gosh does it ever look like a wall of terror Dude, okay, first of all, I've tried to build something like this and it just didn't work out So I wonder how he got this to actually work and he's got two little Props and then all of these cannons tons and tons and tons of cannons and the FPS isn't even hit So I'm guessing that the FPS gets hit more so when you have more blocks than guns and so um, Okay, you guys ready for this? You got to wind these things up Oh my gosh. Okay. How can I get them all to go at one time? I want to look at them. Okay, I, I need free cam mode, I think. We got the majority of them going right there. There we go. Look at that, dude. There's so many shots. Oh my gosh. That is insane. It's absolutely insane. So, uh, the thing is, like, super slow, though. I wonder, do we need to put... I wonder, if, can we improve this by putting bigger bigger props on this thing? Let's try it. Sometimes, we, even putting bigger props on it really messes it up. Like, the front will, like, go shoot up in the air. Yeah, like, uh, it's not too bad. It's still working, but... I think that helped a little bit. We're only at three, four knots full steam ahead yo can we hit this dude oh my gosh I don't know if we can we hit it oh <laughs> we actually hit it that's amazing yes that's so cool I, I, I'm really shocked that we hit that guys I didn't think we were gonna hit it I mean it's like full-on Full on mini guns over here. I think I can aim lower, can't I? There we go. Oh my gosh. It's just non stop, ever shooting destruction. And there's a building right here, I think. Wait, listen to him hit the wall. You hear that? It's like making. Okay, so how can we view? Okay, I think I can move around. Oh, that's up and down. Oh, there we go. How do I move forward? Okay, what? I don't exactly know what's happening. Oh, we're gonna run aground here. Look at this. Okay, can we zoom back in here? Okay, here we go. There we go. Look at that shot. That's awesome. Oh my gosh, so many cannons. That is incredible, man. What a cool build. Wait, I gotta, we gotta test this thing out. Okay, so in the last episode, I made this thing called the Drifter. It is a, it was supposed to be a melee build, but it didn't really work out how I intended. Um, it does have two cannons, and it's back there. And so we're going to go attack it and see what this... I just like the look of this thing. It's just so well built. Now, obviously, I mean, it's not like a practical build or anything. And look, somebody was saying before, like, I think your ship's going backwards because it was turned around or whatever. But look, guys, this is this is facing backwards. We're moving just fine. I don't think it really matters that much. I think the biggest thing is, like, just the turning. Because, you know, left... Well, no, left's turning left, too. But we're going against the waves right now. And every time we go out this way, it's really difficult going, like, actually moving. And so, what I think we'll do is we'll go to this cannon right here. And see if we can't kill this thing from afar. 
That's the only problem though, is like there's no way we can't do that actually. Because there's no way to uh They need to work on the cam or something. It's so difficult to actually like get like a good uh like sh like good view of where to where to shoot and how to shoot. Okay, I think those shots are hitting. Did we just do do a bunch of damage to that thing? Got Oh no, it's fine. I thought I totally hit that thing right there, but I guess not. Maybe these guns aren't that aren't that strong, or maybe I'm hitting the armor. It kinda like launches it backwards sometimes. Okay, we hit some pieces there. Trying to go with the waves here. It's not very not very easy. There we go. Oh yeah, two it's in two pieces. It's in two pieces right now. Yeah. It's still floating though. It's really difficult to to to, it's really difficult to use the use these cams. I think it's just that these cannons don't really do all too much damage. So they're nice to have it all. Mouse indicator in third person view helps you time your shots. It's coming around. I'm trying to get up on this. Joe melee? I didn't I couldn't even get the melee to work last time, which was unfortunate. How do I aim this thing? You have to get some shots are hitting. There we go. There we go. Got it. So it's it's pretty nice, but it's like I think it's not as easy to shoot when you have to grind up because the other cannons you can just hit space and they all fire at one time but those ones you have to actually like hold down the button and so the views get a little weird uh, that's a really cool build though nonetheless and I'm man I'm so excited to see what people make I want to try to build something in this episode like always um, but if you guys have something that you guys have made that you want me to check out leave it in the comment section below link to it in, link to it in steam I mean you can link right to it um, and I'll try to check it out uh, you know what however you guys want to do it just comment below. Tell me what you guys have made. If you want me to check it out or whatever, maybe I can ch maybe I can do that. So uh, let's try to build something new. Okay, so in the last episode, we built like the, that drifter thing, and uh, that worked out pretty well. Uh, in this episode, though, I want to try to build something similar to that, but have a little bit different of a design. And so uh, let's go ahead and let's start building this way. And what I think we'll do is... We'll have a couple coming off like this, maybe four or so, and then uh, let's make this like a double thick type of area, and then let's add on some slants, like so, and then what we're going to do is have a whole nother like thing down here that runs all the way, like the length, like very long, um, but for right now, let's go ahead and just... Do this. Is that a good, enough spacing? I think so. Uh, for what I want to do, you can always use the double blocks. I just like using these ones though. They just work a little bit better. Uh, how many is that? Four. Let's do one more, just to make it a little longer. And then let's bring these out. Do this, and we'll fill this in. Uh, like that and then do that right there okay so that's the base look of what I want right there and then but we do need some something back here though so let's round this off the same in the front there we go Okay, so you can kind of see what I, th I think you can see what I'm trying to do here. It work. Um, and then we need like some weaponry. 
So let's do weapons. We've got the long cannons. We've got mortar shots we really haven't used. More like a lob shot. Flaming cannonball. Power 800. Explosive cannonball. Let's do... Okay, let's do this. Let's do... Should we have these like right here? And then one of these in the middle? Like that? Or should we... Yeah, those are probably fine right there. Because then they don't shoot any of our... They don't shoot anything on our... On our craft. Okay, let's just see what this does. Um, let's name it the... Uh, let's see, we call that one the drifter. We call the one the wave runner. Let's call this one... Uh, I can't even think of any names, guys. Uh... Uh, I can't I can't think of any names let's call it the sled I don't know sled <laughs> it's not a cool name but better than nothing all right let's hit sail does it work it works it's exactly what I wanted to do and then these things are really cool the uh, posts Cause they let you kind of like run railing run railings along the thing. So if we do something like this, oops. So this one will be a little less edited than the ones I have been doing. Oh yeah, that's cool. And then is there anything we could put We need armor. We got to have some armor and melee in the front maybe. Cuz I think these spikes work, the blades don't seem to work though. Well, maybe that's just me. Well, it appeared that way to me, though, at least. Shield armor? Kind of interesting. It's probably a lot of weight, though. Whoops, undo that. Um, weight 100. Weight 75, actually. Okay. We'll do it back here too. Kind of looks <laughs> kind of looks dumb. Let's let's dang it! I keep deleting that one. There we go. Okay, this is still go. Yeah, it still works. Sweet. It's not very fast though. It's not too bad. But yeah, it's uh, pretty maneuverable. And it does exactly what I wanted it to do. Although it's sitting barely up out of the water. It's not bad though. It's working quite well. What if we do the bigger pro props? I got I got to have more speed, guys. We got to have more speed. Could do a sail too. An extra large one. Guys, you can literally get the extra large. Main mast bad. Why can't I put that down though? Too much weight or something? I put it in the front? That doesn't help. You need rotate blocks and current attachment point. Maybe it's maybe it's up over those railings. Huh, I wonder why I can't put that down there. It's gotta be the railings. It's gotta be the railings. It's like inter like some interference. So what if we do a a well, let's just do, yeah, we'll do barrel. Let's do barrel. And then what if we, is that going to let it work? Wrong way. The wind is really tricky in this game. It really messes up. Drop the sails! Oh my gosh, this thing is ridiculous, man. Eight knots, though, look at that. 
Uh, where is the wind? Once we catch the wind. Nine? You can even, you'll even see the sails change. There we go. Sixteen. Look at that. The Kraken wakes. No, it doesn't. It's not in the game yet. There we go. Look at that. Twenty. Dude, we are freaking flying right now. <laughs> Speedy. The speed. Speed demon. What do you call these boats? Like, uh... Hmm. What, are they, what are they called? They're called something specific. Like, they're like the race boats. Oh, it's a catamaran. Catamaran. Yeah, it's like a catamaran. Cool. It's worthy of upload, I think. Once it hits that wind, though, man. Whew. Thing flies. How do you tell where the wind is coming from? Okay. I think that means the wind is pushing against us. So, if I l go this way... I think the arrow is indicating where the wind is. Wind is behind us. Correct? We do we are freaking flying right now. We got 25 knots at one point, 22. But that's come when we're coming up out of the water though. Dude, this is a cool build. I'm excited about this. Well, guys, let me know what you think of the build. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, click that thumbs up button below. Feel free to subscribe if you're new. Thank you guys for the support in the series. I really appreciate it. And I hope you guys are enjoying this game and the videos. Thank you so much, guys. I'll see you in the next one.